Wednesday, right? Wednesday. Feels like it's Wednesday. Um, so we've got a lot up on the board today. Everything is focusing on core. Um, some cardio in there as well. Um, uh, four stations, you can start anywhere. And um, you guys have your option throughout the whole workout. So um, it's always kind of what I say during this workout. If you don't like this workout, it's your own fault. Because you get to pick what you do. Okay? So um, each station is going to be nine minutes, I believe, in duration. And uh, there's an active rest at the top. So if we're doing station one, partner number one gets in a plank. They don't get out of their plank until partner two finishes their pick of these four. If there's one that you really don't like, you can cycle through the other three. If there's three that you don't like, you can do the one that you do. Okay, if you don't like all four, sorry. Maybe hopefully you'll like stuff in the other station. You gotta at least pick one, okay? So uh, how we like to suggest you do it is you just pick the top one. Then go back in your plank, when you come out, you pick the second one. Go back in your plank, when you come out, get the third one. Okay, and just cycle through it and see how many times you can do it, that way you get a little bit of variety. Uh, any questions on how it's ran? All right, guys, let's dive right in. Plank is your active rest number one, okay? Um, I would go down, especially since yesterday was shoulder day, okay? Avoid your palm plank, go down into your forearm plank, get your core a little more. Uh, 15, hanging knee tucks is our first option, okay? Bringing the knees up to the chest and then a good release back on down. Number 10, or excuse me, number two up here, we got 10 weighted burpees. So uh, get yourself a pair of dumbbells. Uh, we're doing the same thing as regular burpee, except we're doing it with dumbbells in our hands. Okay, chest down, then a good explosion on the way back up. 20 band side crunches. So a lot of times we give you guys the option of which uh, band crunch to do, but today we are gonna work on the side crunches. So let's take our elbow down to uh, the same side um, and making sure that we're getting a good oblique squeeze there. Uh, so again, being down on your heels, we don't want to be up and then coming back down and using the momentum of the band. Um, and then get on the edge of a box here, guys. I think it'll be more comfortable for your 30 um, single leg can openers. Um, for this one, guys, remember, we are having the hands kind of back by our booty for support. Bringing the leg all the way up and all the way down before the other leg comes up. And if not, it becomes a scissor kick at that point. Okay, we want to up, control it on the way down, up, control it on the way down. Okay, for a total of 30. Station number two, active rest is going to be on the bike. Your partner is going to sprint down to that side uh, before they perform the exercises. Uh, 15 sit-ups will be our first one. Lay down, cross the arms, cross the shoulders, elbows come up to the knees. 50 mountain climbers, knees into the chest. 15 cherry bombs, all the way sprawled out, and then bring it back into your ball. And then 15 side crunches, we're going to lay on our side. Knees come folded over to the side, and it's not a very big movement here, guys. Just a nice little subtle crunch. Uh, 15 on one side, flip it over, and then 15 on the other side. Station number three. Diamond crunch is the active rest. So we're gonna keep that diamond on our forehead and we are just staying busy here, guys. Don't get in a big hurry because you're gonna be there for a while. So take your good slow pace, get a good burn in your obliques. 12 plate overs. For this one, I uh, want your feet dug into the ground. Um, I know more advanced people like to keep their feet off the ground, uh, but that makes it too much about balance and not enough about your core burn and your rotation. So up, over, slow pause, and then on your way down. Keeping your arms bent at 90 degrees because if they start to extend at the bottom, then you just kind of start curling it over your body, and we want your core to do the work. 20 Bosu crunches. So this time we're putting the low part of our back on that center part of the ball. Okay, we're getting a good stretch, and then we are crunching up. Uh, if your top part of the back's on the middle part of the Bosu ball, you're not gonna get any stretch, and it's a super, super easy crunch at that point, all right? So make sure that that low part of your back is on the center part of the ball. 30 Russian twists, okay? Can be done with or without weight. Uh, doesn't matter. Feet are elevated this time, and we are taking it from side to side, so this is more of that balance where you're working more of that cardio core um, and endurance there. Uh, 100 high knees, okay? Pump those arms. Get those knees up there uh, for a total of 100. Get your cardio up a little bit. Station number four is ran a little differently. As you see, there are no rep counts, so you will just be doing whatever this movement is until your partner gets back from their hill. Muffin Top Eliminators, it works both sides. So how you can do it is you can either take two turns or two hills. So work your right side on your first turn, work your left side on your second turn, or you can switch when your partner gets to the bottom of the hill, okay? Work the right side on the way down, work the left side on the way up, up to you guys there. Uh, soccer taps, with your kettlebell down on the floor, we're just looking to keep those feet moving, okay? Kicking or tapping, 
the kettlebell. In and outs. Okay, this is going to burn your legs. That's a leg day, but it's a good one. Okay, you go down into your squat, and you go in with your both legs, and then out with both legs. Okay, in, in, out, out. In, in, out, out. Uh, and then boat is going to be our last one. So out there outside, uh, just get yourself comfortable um, in that boat position. Maybe even row the boat a little bit if you have a dumb up. Okay. Um, and that's about it. Any questions? No questions? All right, guys, um, let's get two hills for a warm-up, and let's come back in here and let's get started.